Item 12 refers to the following Venn diagram of two intersecting sets which is partially shaded. Okay, so you see only P is shaded. In the Venn diagram, the unshaded area represents, you tell me, which one? Alright, let's see what happened here. Is it P complement? If you should shade P complement, you would shade outside of P. So, that is not what it represents because that shade area would be shaded too. Is it Q complement? <coughs> if you shade Q complement, it means what is outside of Q and here. This should not be shaded if you shade Q complement. So, B is not it. Let's see what happened here. P intersect Q complement. Q complement would be all of these. P intersect that. P would be only in here. P intersect Q complement would be all around here. So, P intersect Q complement. This is not in Q complement. So, it's not C either. It's not A. It's not B. It's not C. I wonder what else is left. Oh, Q. Hmm. Um, D. Now, this is something. Q intersect P complement. You see P complement. P complement would be all of these things here. Alright, let me shade it the right way. P complement would be all of these. Right? And you're looking for Q intersect that Q intersect P complement would be over here it would be all around here Q intersect P complement P complement P complement would be this and Q is this so, the unshaded area includes. So, let's look at again at the unshaded area. You see in here, Q intersect P complement will not be there. So, we see that nothing wrong with this, but here now, this is the unshaded area. Q intersects something. It intersects P complement. P complement is outside of P. Q intersect P complement. P complement is all around here and Q intersect that is indeed what we see here as the unshaded area. Right? Remember, this intersection here is not in P complement. So the only answer that we get from here is D. So question 12, answer D.